Hi, this is Tara for HealingCrystals.com and this is the Astrology Report for the week of December 16th through December 22nd. Changes are coming. Fall's about to come to an end. Are you ready for it? On Wednesday. Things are going to be very interesting um, because typically when Saturn's in a transit, it's the voice of reason. But Saturn's on a tour through Sagittarius right now, and that's kind of lightening Saturn's normal, somber demeanor a little bit. Um, so on Wednesday, it's going to be in a transit with Mercury, and Mercury is in Capricorn, and Capricorn is kind of dragging Mercury's energy down a little bit, making it a little more pessimistic than usual. So when you're working with these planets on Wednesday, you want to use Saturn as, as um, a source of enthusiasm, particularly when it comes to making choices. And you want to use Mercury as kind of the voice of reason, as, as energy that can help you to see the, down, the potential downsides and the potential upsides so that you can take a more balanced approach to things. Sometimes you have to mix things up and you have to like try different different approaches to things and and this is definitely one of those days to do that. It's, it, it's a good time to break out of old patterns and try something new. Be cautious on Friday um, because Venus and Uranus are going to make you very impulsive and it's a dangerous time of year anyway. Um, with all the sales going on and a lot of pushes to buy, 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 it's kind of hard to, to control your impulses as it is. You want to be particularly careful on Friday. Um, on Saturday, Pluto and Mercury are going to make you very thoughtful and assertive when it comes to, to um, going after what you want. You're going to feel very motivated and ready to take action and go for it. And you definitely want to do that on Saturday because by the time Sunday rolls around, you are not going to feel like doing anything. Part of it is that the energy on Sunday, things are just going to feel very monotonous. And the other part of it is that there's just going to, it's going to feel like there's too many obstacles in your way and, and it's just not worth the effort. The energy does get better later in the day, but I advise that you wait until Monday because on Monday, Monday is the winter solstice, you're going to have a whole bunch of fresh new energy coming your way and you're going to it, it, you're gonna want to take advantage of it. Um, it it's kind of like, like a, a cold wind coming through and just like waking you up if you will. Uh, although it may not be cold, I, who knows? You know, it's it's 60 degrees here in the, in the middle of December right now where I live, so um, which is very unusual. Um, I lost my train of thought there. Mercury and Chiron, um, yeah, Mercury and Chiron are working together on Monday, and they're going to help you to feel really comfortable with with yourself and with initiating changes, and in particular, tackling old problems with a new outlook. Remember what I said about Wednesday. This is overall a really good week to try different things, to look at things in a different way. Stop doing the same old thing because all you're doing is getting the same old results. It's not always easy to try something new, but this is a good week. You've got a lot of energy that's going to back you up, that's going to help you to feel a little more, you know, maybe when you've got that Venus Ur Uranus um, Im impulse energy coming at you, use it to, to try something healthy, something different, um, instead of going and buying something that you probably don't need, like I'll end up doing. Anyway, um... Uh, that energy, that, that like really positive, go get them, you know, mix it up kind of energy is going to carry through on Tuesday. This time it's going to be Mars and Chiron. And they're going to encourage you to be assertive and to fight for what you want. Not aggressively. This isn't about being aggressive. Chiron is going to calm that energy with Mars. This energy is about being creative. Again, trying something different still being strong, being assertive, going after what you want, but not in a combative kind of a way, in a creative kind of a way. Um, so here's the crystals that I'm going to carry with me this week. Um, first of all, we're going to have smoky quartz for confidence. Um, Halolite is wonderful for passion and for commitment. 
And finally, serpentine, because serpentine can help you to realize just how empowering and healing it can be to take a stand and stick to it. And I think, you know, with, with a new season coming on, that's a good philosophy to have a new season, a new year. You know what? You deserve the best. So go after it, whatever it is that you want, go after it and get it. Don't forget to check out the weekly and daily horoscopes on HealingCrystals.com and on our Facebook page, Crystal Talk. Have a magical week and enjoy the first day of winter.